what's going on everyone? Look at you here. So, a while ago I was watching this show over on IGN's channel called Link Together, which I highly recommend. It is absolutely hilarious. But basically what they do on the show is they're playing Breath of the Wild, uh, two guys from IGN playing Breath of the Wild, one with the right Joy-Con and one with the left Joy-Con. Um, and it looked like a lot of fun, so I actually, I've, I tried it doing it that way with a few few people, um, including my brother, a couple of my friends, uh, where I'd play with the right Joy-Con and the friend would play with the left Joy-Con. And it made me realize something. The Switch is the only console you can do that with. And also, it's incredibly fun. Like, really, if you have a Switch and you have, like, Breath of the Wild or Splatoon or any, any game on the Switch at all, I think, playing with the split Joy-Con is actually a really awesome experience. Because you and the person that you're playing with basically fun function each of you as like half of a brain, the right and left brain of the single character there that you're controlling. And there's so much teamwork required in it. And really, it's a fantastic team co-op experience that was kind of unintentionally put in whenever, the, whenever Nintendo made the Switch. Like, I can't emphasize this enough. When you're playing Breath of the Wild and you, you're you constantly relying on your teammates to help you do the exact right movements and um, plan in conjunction with each other um, what each person is going to do, um, it really, I think, builds a really great teamwork experience and eventually you kind of get used to each other and know what each person is going to do. Because, I mean, one person is controlling the camera. And another person is controlling the movement. Um, one person is controlling, like, swapping in between weapons, while another person is controlling, like, jumping. One person is controlling locking on enemies, while the other is in charge of attacking the enemies. It, it really balances out so well, and each person has, I think, just about the right amount of control, that it makes for an incredible experience. And I really think that that's also something that Nintendo can probably take into account with, like, their future games and stuff. Like, I mean, obviously, with any game that Nintendo comes out with, you can t hand a Joy-Con to one person and play it, um, like I just said, with right brain, left brain. But if Nintendo made some sort of a game where it's actually designed to be played that way, I think that there's a lot of potential there. Um, I can't think of any ideas off the top of my head, but... I, I mean... I think that there's a lot of potential there, and um, I hope that Nintendo eventually kind of digs into that and uh, works on this sort of co-op multiplayer that they unintentionally created. Well, anyways, guys, if you have a Switch, again, if you have a Switch and any games on it, then you and you have a friend who is interested in these games, you need to try playing it like this sometime. It is really such a fun experience. Well, anyways, guys, that's all I've got today. Um, if you're new to the channel, I talk about everything Nintendo, Nintendo Switch, uh, Breath of the Wild, Splatoon. And uh, you can subscribe to my channel right up here and check out my latest video up here. Anyways, guys, I will see you in the next one.